Okay, today's video is going to show you how to clean your hamster's water bottle. If you guys have ever noticed that there's a buildup appearing on the ball end of your water bottle, what that is is you probably have hard water and that's just a calcium buildup on the end. Now, if this goes without being cleaned for too long, it can start to affect how the water comes out and your hamster won't be able to get any. So it's good to go through, you know, it could be every month or too much, just depending on how fast it happens and just go through and clean them. All you're going to need is just some vinegar and you can just pour them in bowls like you see here. As you can see I already have one soaking in some vinegar and then these two bowls are just plain water. So we're going to take this one out since it's already done and go ahead and place it in the water so it can start to get the vinegar off because obviously you don't want to put it back in your hamster's cage with you know the vinegar on it. So as you can see this one has got it pretty bad and so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick this in the vinegar and just let it sit there for a while and actually it's going to stick another one in there and then we'll check on it in a few minutes all right now i'm going to show you what to do to help speed up the process as well as getting some of it off if it's really stuck on so you're just going to take a paper towel and then to go ahead and take your water bottle cap and try to shake out some of the vinegar in it then you're just going to wipe it which will just give that little bit of vinegar residue left onto the paper towel and you can just lightly rub it off with just some light pressure and that's all you have to do. Now your water bottle cap will be all nice and clean. So what I do is I then just kind of shake off the leftover vinegar that might be up inside of it. Once you're done shaking the vinegar out of it you can just go ahead and place it in your bowl of water and let it soak in there. This will just help get some of the vinegar off and out of it and then you can just rinse it off and give it back to your hamsters. Okay, after all of the cleaning is done, you can go and thoroughly rinse out and wash your hamster's water bottle cap so there is no longer any residue on the outside or inside of the cap. And then you can fill the water bottle back up and return it to their cage. And after you do that, you can sit back and watch your hamster come out and sniff out its new water bottle. Or if you're Emma, you have to entirely check it all over to make sure it's okay. So that's it guys. I hope this helps you guys clean your hamster's water bottle. And as I said, you can do this every month or so. It just depends on how fast the lime scale builds up. So just take it off and clean it and that's all there is to it. So if you guys have any more video suggestions that you'd like to see me do, just leave them down below. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!